So you're planning to call your locks one week from today, but you have some buildup. Don't do it. Here's what you can do instead. Ciao, boom. Let me see, maybe I can do the roots. I'll just touch up maybe the ends. That means I'm gonna call it anyway, partner. Wow. You're gonna do it anyway, aren't you? Okay, well, here's what you can do to minimize damage. <laughs> Approximately one and a half weeks before your color job, you wanna take one teaspoon of apple cider vinegar to approximately eight ounces of water. It could be room temperature. Dump that onto your hair and leave it on for half an hour. Now, as the hair is stewing, you're going to take the locks and gently agitate them back and forth. The idea is to loosen any dirt and buildup that's in there. You're getting the hair ready to be washed out. Next, you're gonna combine equal parts of your favorite moisturizing conditioner with your favorite protein conditioner. Put both of those together in a very watery consistency. It should look something like this. It has to be thin enough to penetrate uh, the locks to the core to do the job. And by the way, you want your shampoo to be this consistency also because you don't want to put back in additional uh, buildup from your shampoo because it's too now, thick. Midway through the week, you're going to repeat that apple cider vinegar and then protein moisture process again. What you're really doing is layering treatments to take out the buildup, but then building the hair back up with protein and moisture treatments that it will need to strengthen the hair prior to coloring. And you're also doing it because you want to replace the moisture that is lost from the ACB treatment. Now your hair is ready for the coloring treatment. And if you're doing it at home, please follow the manufacturer's instructions. Once the coloring job is complete, you'll want to go back in with that conditioner protein treatment and put that onto the locks. You have to replace the moisture protein that is lost during the coloring process. When the coloring job is complete, your hair should still feel very moisturized and strong because that protein moisture uh, concoction should have gone in there to do the job. Quick tip, if you're using a commercial product to color, a week and a half to two weeks after your processing job, you can go over that color with a clear colorance. I know L'Oreal makes a really good one. Go in with a clear colorance and put that over the color job, that's going to make it last even longer. But if you decide to be a good girl or boy and hold off on the color treatment to deal with the buildup, I suggest using the prescription that I showed you for at least two and a half weeks and then go in and color your locks. Give it that beautiful color that you've always wanted. Okay, lock lovers, until next time.